behind the gate. They're off in the Shuvi Handicap and Louis Capote. Comes out first, Louis Capote with the lead by a length. On the outside is for all seasons. Sky Beauty on the inside is third. Then it's a gap of five lengths to Silky Feather racing fourth. They move down the back stretch. Louis Capote the lead by a neck. Sky Beauty on the rail is now second by a length. For all seasons on the outside is third. Then it's six lengths to Silky Feather in fourth. The first quarter went in 23 and one. Sky Beauty on the inside now joins Louis Capote for the lead. They're heads apart. It's two lengths, two for all seasons in third, then four and a half to Silky Feather racing fourth. And now they're moving into the far turn. The half mile in 45 and four. Sky Beauty on the rail now with a head in front. Louis Capote on the outside is second by a length. For all seasons on the outside is third. Five lengths to Silky Feather and fourth. They're midway on the turn. Sky Beauty, Louis Capote still together for all seasons now. Makes her move on the outside. Three quarters, 109 and three. Sky Beauty has now taken the lead as they come for the head of the stretch. And Sky Beauty has the lead now by three lengths. For all seasons is second. Louis Capote has dropped back. Then it's Silky Feather coming for the eighth pole. And Sky Beauty is doing it again. It's Sky Beauty by six lengths. For all seasons is second. They pass the 16th pole. And here she is, the queen of Belmont Park. Sky Beauty winning it here by eight lengths. For all seasons was second. Sky Beauty wins the Shuvi Handicap. Ladies and gentlemen, returning to the winner's circle now is number two, Sky Beauty, with Mike Smith aboard. Ladies and gentlemen, in the winner's circle, Mr. Dale Monteith, the chief executive of Caulfield and Sandown Racecourses in Australia, making the presentation to Georgia Hoffman, owner of Sky Beauty, winner of today's Shoe V Handicap. 